your discretion. Hey everybody, it's the Fobra. And, you know, I, I've vlogged about this probably six times so far, and I can't put it together. And the topic I keep trying to talk about is why I choose to ride after my, after my injury, after my accident. And to be quite honest with you, I, I just, I can't get the words out. So I, I'm gonna preface it by saying that. Um, it's been about four months since my accident, and it's a friggin' miracle. I hate when they blow that shit around. It's a miracle that I'm even on the bike. But I've worked my ass off to get here. Lots of therapy, lots of exercises, lots of vitamins, lots of everything. I mean, I've done everything that they've asked me to do. Everything. Um, and still, I'm, I'm not 100%. I'm not. Come on. Let's go, sweetheart. I'm not 100%. And... I'm really looking forward to the day where I will be. I'm hoping it'll be by the spring, but even though, who knows about that, I, you know. <clears throat> but why did I get back on a bike? I love riding, I love it. <clears throat> I love the experiences I have with my buddies. Um, I love the places I've been, all of these, and all the people of YouTube and, and motovlogging and the motorcycle community, I, I wouldn't have met any of you, I wouldn't have any of those experiences if it wasn't for Motorcycling. Come on, what do you need? An invitation? You're cordially invited to go. <laughs> but at the same time, when I come up on a side street like this, I'm always looking for the person who's going to come flying out and, and hit me. And uh, it's not a fun way to ride. It's not a fun way to ride. There's no... I find that there's very little re relaxation. Uh, last time I was out with the guys, I actually was humming a song to myself, which might sound insane, but what it did was it took the... Uh, it took all the thoughts out. It took all my thoughts away and made me just concentrate on enjoying the ride and I had a, a great ride then. Um, so I don't know what the answer is. I guess my question for everybody out there is, you know, after you have a, uh, an injury, after you have a, uh, an accident, a crash, whatever, how do you get over it? How long does it take you to get over? Uh, I want to ride. I enjoy riding and I didn't want that taken away by somebody, by the person who hit me because it was, like I said, 150% their fault. And, you know, it's something you gotta work through. And uh, I wanna put the work in, and I wanna, I wanna enjoy riding the way I used to. So, I don't know guys, that's, and, uh, that's pretty much my question. I know a lot of you out there have had uh, accidents and injuries from moderate to severe. I mean, thank God it wasn't life altering you know, long term for me. Short term, yes, but not long term. I, I God, I hope not. So I'd love to get your feedback on that. And uh, in the meantime, take care, and uh, I'll see you. I saw. I, I've checked out three motorbikes. Uh, two uh, uh, two wheels. Uh, uh, I did have uh, uh, five years. I've had the and six four tail bag. I jump on it on my. And it's kind of cool from a non-gamer 